What were some of the challenges, if any, that you faced in developing um, Portugal.net? Well, the biggest challenge, really, from the from the very start, and it continues to be the biggest challenge today, is just finding time to write. You know, all the articles. There's so much news which has to be covered if you, if you want to do a good job on, you know, to try and cover all aspects of Portuguese football. And it's just very difficult finding time to cover everything. Uh, that obviously has been helped by the fact that we've had a lot of. Uh, a lot of contributors, a lot more contributors writing and you know, really good quality writers that come on board and then as the site has kind of organically grown and people have, uh, have got to realise it's a good place to go and, uh, to go and find, out, find out the news about Portuguese football that also has uh, had a kind of snowball effect and more people have offered their services to, to write about the game in English and uh, that continues to be the most difficult aspect, finding time to, to write, uh, to cover all the news you know, in depth because the site is a non-profit site.